everyone, Gigi of Gigi Eats Celebrities here and I'm sitting in my car right now because I actually just got to the location of a movie shoot that I am the craft service director for. <laughs> of course, put me in charge of the food. Now, a very, very handsome man I know wrote a script for a comedic movie about five years ago and he's finally putting it into action by directing it, starring in it, producing it, doing everything. However, he did enlist my services to help him with the food, so that's what I did. I got this company called My Power Supply to cater. All of their meals are allergen friendly and so freaking good. I remember when I tried them, I, I was obsessed. The second I took one bite, I was like, oh no, oh no. It's like me and salmon. The second I take a bite of salmon, I never wanna stop. So, throughout this video, you are gonna see a behind the scenes look, what it takes to star in, film, direct, and produce a movie, and you might actually see some familiar faces. As you can see right here, my car, Wolfie, is full to the brim with lighting equipment, jibs, booms, I don't even know what the heck is in here, but there is a lot of stuff in here. Anyways, since I am so punctual, I'm actually here at the location first, and the power happens to not be working right now, so it's a little bit creepy, so I'm gonna sit in my car and really hope for the best and I need to get those really really creepy thoughts out of my head right now because if I keep thinking about them I'm gonna start crying because I'm scared <laughs> but anyway call time tomorrow is 10 a.m. and that is when my power supply is going to deliver all the goods all right day number one is already taking place and I'm outside right now because they're filming in the kitchen and I don't need to interrupt the first thing that you guys all need to know is that on movie sets everything that can go wrong will go wrong. However, I'm gonna put it in the universe that nothing else goes wrong. Nothing. And action. What's this? Drink on the job. And I want to give a little more play. Right now we've got a large separation from you guys. Action. So this has been about four years in the making. But we've we spent enough time I think putting the script together and reworking things that this is going to be absolutely brilliant. Matt was talking, but I didn't hear a single thing that came out of his mouth. I was just thinking about pumpkin seeds. Summertime in the Alps. Underpants, just fell. Underpants. <laughs> well, those are mine. Okay. <laughs> Currently production is filming outside, so I have the kitchen all to myself. And as you can see right here, that is a sad, sad, sad piece of sandwich, which is what the whole movie is based around. Now, let me show you what Power Supply got us. Buffalo chicken with cumin, carrot, and raisin salad. Looks delicious. It smells so good, by the way. Caribbean chicken with mango cabbage slaw. And last but not least, they gave us caveman stuffed peppers. This right here is ground beef stuffed bell peppers. Smells absolutely awesome. Oh, it tastes just like tomato sauce, meaty tomato sauce. There is a whole bell pepper. This is just all fresh ingredients and you can pronounce everything that's in it. It's 100% healthy and let's hope that the cast and crew absolutely love this as much as my mouth does. I want this one, I want all of them. Okay, first bite. I'm trying to start biting that. Oh my God. It's amazing. Up. Ground beef stuffed pepper. <laughs> mm. Tastes like a meatloaf. Mm. On a scale from Wendy Dicky sledgehammer. I give it two sledgehammers. Yum. Um, <laughs> I forgot. Oh, that so was really <laughs> sexy. I'm um, licking the knees. Yeah. It's good. It's good? Okay. It's fresh. It's Which good. one did you get? Uh, buffalo chicken one. This is gonna sound really funny, but I'm in the closet right now because I do not want to disturb the set. Everyone has been regaling over how amazingly delicious these meals are. I'm hungry, so I am going to eat the buffalo chicken power supply meal. What I really love is that I know every single ingredient that is in this. Okay, let's try the buffalo chicken. How did I know this was gonna be amazing? Ooh, it's a little, there's a little bit of a kick in there. I like it. Shoot day number two is currently underway. They are setting up production down at a different house and we're gonna go check that out now. I won't lie to you, last night I definitely fell asleep so I did not see the end of the shoot. However, I know it went well. Looking at Dickie, we have our whole conversation this way 
times going terms this way. And then we have a whole lot going this way and that way. Yeah, then I take a bite because you so you walk up to him your question. No way. So if he says no way, would I take a bite anyways? Yeah. You, whatever you whatever you just say honey baked ham. Honey baked. Production is currently underway. They are shooting a scenes in a garage down at the other house. So I'm actually coming up to the main house because I'm really hungry, so I need some more power supply. Yay. Final meal I'm going to try is the Caribbean chicken. This right here is the Caribbean chicken. And here we go. And action, Landon, come on out. All right, guys, it's day number two, nighttime. We have one more shot. The shots are looking so good. I am so excited for this movie. I'm so excited for everyone who's worked on it. And you know why it's all so good? Because they fueled up with power supply. <laughs> Anyways, let's go check out the last couple of scenes and then we're done for the night. Let's walk us through it do while I do, I do this. Do you want to do it again? Or were you happy? Uh, oh, you can't get that any better. I, I, I love this. is epic. It's fucking epic right there. That's slow-mo, isn't it? No. no. That's it's you perfect. reacting slowly. Oh, man. That's fucking <laughs> awesome. I'm so <laughs> good. <laughs> You're so what? Good. Oh, he's such a hero. All right. We've got other shots to do, so let's do them. Hey, great job on that Don't one, Matt. Don't you want to punch that was nice. Thanks, baby. Katie, awesome no. job on that. No. Awesome. Wrap for this location. There we go. So everyone, I am on my way to shoot date number three. Now we're back in Hollywood as opposed to Simi Valley and we are shooting at a different location. Should be really interesting and the lights in my car just went off, whatever. <laughs> I have all the equipment so if I didn't show up to set, they would be screwed, screwed I tell you. But I'm here and I'm going to drive on the sidewalk apparently so they can unload all this crap and get Get the shoot going. Drama. Time to play with my hard boss. Yep, and then you're pointing at him. <laughs> That's a wrap on here, guys. It's a wrap on here. Well done. No, I didn't ask you. Love you, man. It was so good. Can I be you? I want to be Dickie. I need an adult. Well, that's it, guys. It's a wrap on Dickie Sledgehammer for now. They have to do a couple pickups and a few more scenes, but I won't be included in that unless they need my car's back seat, but we'll get there when we get there. The movie is looking absolutely phenomenal, and I'm not just saying that because I happen to have a crush on someone in particular in the movie. And, you know, I think everyone else on the entire project is awesome. But seriously, I, I'm like, I'm speechless about how good, how good this movie looks. I cannot wait for all of you to see it. I will definitely be sharing it. But right now, I need to thank my power supply for supplying all of the food because we were not hungry at all. It was awesome. It fed us so well. The meals are so healthy and so fresh and so amazing. And honestly, everyone kept talking about them. So clearly, my power supply is doing something right. Anyways, I hope you guys all enjoyed this little mashup video of behind the scenes look of Dickie Sledgehammer. Now, don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel because a new video is coming next week, of course. Oh, in the comments below, let me know what your favorite movie is and if you've ever been on a movie set before. Peace. Whoa.